showing you some inspiration for cubicle decor, what I personally did to my cubicle, and how I stay motivated at work. I'll also be showing you a DIY USB powered geometric plant terrarium LED light. I get a lot of compliments on it and it really makes your desk pop. I personally like to create a motivating environment. I like to have a little candy um, in my cubicle just so people know that I'm approachable because if you ask any of my coworkers today, they'll probably tell you that I'm a very quiet and reserved person and that is true at first. Once you get to know me, it's different. But I feel like once they see my environment, they'll know that it's a very welcoming environment, that they'll see the type of person that I am, what I like, and stuff like that. Okay, now for the DIY Geometric Plant Terrarium USB LED light lamp, I'm going to need a gold geometric terrarium, I'm going to need an artificial succulent, and I'm going to need a um, some USB operated LED lights. Everything will be linked down below in the description. So first arrange the succulent wherever you want to place it, then slowly put in the LED lights, um, arrange them however you want. I'm just going to put them all um, in back of the succulent and I'm just going to plug it in. That is literally it. That's all you need to get this beautiful little lamp on your cubicle. You can have it on um, as soon as you get there in the office. People know you're there and you're going to get lots of compliments on it. It really makes your desk pop. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to Walgreens dot com and I'm going to order some prints so that I can put in my little string lights but first I'm going to go ahead and order my prints so I go to the Walgreens app I select photo I select prints and oh there's a coupon code um, so I'm going to use that um, this is 25% off not sponsored by the way I wish okay go ahead and choose your photos Okay, and then I'm going to choose a wallet size photo for all nine of my pictures. So that's a two by three and they come in packs of four, so you are going to have to cut them. But I like the um, pictures to be all the same size and um, I can see that I have nine two by three pictures. It tells me the total will be 668. Okay, so I'm going to grab my string lights. This is the Firefly mini clips that I got at Hobby Lobby. You can use it for your photos or notes. In my case, I'll grab my 2x3 photos and hang them on there. They're easy to come off and they have cute hashtags like goals and mood and lit. So I'm going to grab a picture, grab my clippy thing, and that's it. Do the same for the rest of my pictures. And this is what the final look is for the string lights. Now I'm going to give you a quick tour of what's in my cubicle and what keeps me motivated throughout the day. Let's start off with my drawers. I have motivational magnets and my Opaso magnet to remind me of home. Nothing really crazy in there other than the essentials, some hot sauce and chips. In my board, I like to write myself cute messages like stay focused, stay motivated, and I like to write my goals to remind me what I need to get done throughout the week. I also have a cozy blanket because it does get really cold and a fan because it can get really hot. You can never be too sure of what I'm going to feel. I like to start my morning with a positive thought and this one I got at Altered State. It's not what we have in life, but who we have in our lives that matters. I have my home fragrance. Um, I have a webcam blocker so I can open it and close it whenever I like. I also like to have a mirror because I don't want anybody creeping up on me. I have gold little stationary items, some cute sticky notes, and gold pins, tissues, and some flowers in my little jug because you gotta stay hydrated. Um, I have a phone holder and my dream catcher, and this is what it looks like. Plain old cubicle turned into a great motivational space for me throughout the workday. So thank you 
thank you for watching today's video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. See you next time.